So here we are in William Walsham Howe's Abbey Church, where he ministered as curate, uh, after his time in Kidderminster, where Richard Baxter will be going there tomorrow. So you'll see that. And we're going to sing, what's his most famous hymn? For All the Saints. For All the Saints. Who wrote the music for this? Ray Fon Williams. Ray Fon Williams. I thought it was Ralph. No, it's and a uh, great title for that. What's the title of that? Stacey? And what does that mean? Without a, name. Without a name. Great, good. So the Abbey Church founded in 1083. And we're going to see, uh, we'll wait till the bells quit there and we'll do a little sweep here. Great organ. That's where William Walsham Howe would have preached right there, probably a number of times. Unfortunately, William Walsham Howe's preaching would not have been his strong suit. Um, because he was, he was not unaffected by the, the, the uh, higher criticism of the Bible that was happening in uh, the 19th century when he was here. So he gets it right in the hymn, but he wouldn't have gotten it right in the pulpit. And that seems to be often what happens. One of the reasons why we need the hymns so badly is that the hymn writers get it right, even bad preaching hymn writers get it right okay margaret of the Here we go. almost perfect pitch for all the, the saints who from their labors rest who thee by faith before the world confessed thy name O jesus be forever blessed and their might now captain in the well fought fight thou in the darkness drear their one true light oh hallelujah oh hallelujah Faithful, true, and bold, fight as the saints who nobly fought of old, and win with them the victor's crown of gold.